I'm working on a large painting of a Belgian Malinois. It's going to be a close-up of the dog's face. I have brushes and colors out, and here's the painting thus far. And to give you an idea how large it is, there's my hand compared to it. Hey, Blaine, come over here. Can you show everybody? Come here, Blaine. Blink. Come here, baby. Okay, Blink, come. Good dog. Sit. Sit. Good, sit. So there's Blink in front of the painting to give you an idea how large it is. Okay, Blink. That's enough. Okay, sweetheart. Come on. Good girl. That's my baby. Good job, girl. And so anyhow, I'm just, just laying in my darks, which I, I like to do. Thus far, I've only used three brushes and a palette knife. So I'm using my big brushes for the, the large areas. And then I am doing blending with the, the medium size brush. And I'm using a small brush just to, to feather in, like I've got this, this white in here just to feather the edges. And um, got a really neat gray here. It's, it's called Torrent Gray and the painting com paint companies make it at the end of each year. And how they come up with this gray is they take the extra paint they have in all the different colors and mix it together, which makes gray. So each year you can only get the torrent gray while they have it in stock and it will be a different color each year. So here it is. Torrent gray, T O R R I T gray. So I always look forward to trying getting a few tubes of that at the end of the year. Well, thank you for taking a peek at my oil painting of a Belgian Malinois, and I will do some check ins in a little while to show you where I am. But uh, it's going to be a really cool painting and it's going to a house in East Texas. So anyhow, here it is. And uh, I love doing these big paintings. I just think they're, they're smashing to do. And, uh, you know, it's, uh, it's very fun. We'll see, we'll check in with y'all as the painting progresses. Thanks for taking a peek.